In every situation, from a yogic perspective, there are two things at play, what we call Shiva and Shakti, consciousness and energy, being and becoming, knowledge and action. And so if the entirety of the universe is composed of these two qualities, which are inseparable, it can sometimes mean that we have to know when to take which stance. So what I mean by that is that in any situation, not only is there the Shiva Shakti nature, but there's also ultimate reality and relative reality. The rich philosophical tradition of India says that nature exists in a state of fullness, perfection, wholeness. But sometimes when we're stuck in modes of contraction or suffering, it's hard to remember ultimate reality. We have to work with relative reality. We have to start from where we're at. So part of the tantric methodology is using your own relative reality to help you experience ultimate reality. So use your likes, use your dislikes, use your suffering, use your talents. Everything that you have is a workable opportunity to experience the fullness of your own being. So sometimes we have to know when to take the seat of ultimate reality, which is what we could call Shiva Asana. And sometimes we have to remember the relative reality and work with what's at play here and now. We could call that Shakti Asana. So in my workshop, 2020 Visions, we'll be exploring the components of Shiva and Shakti and practices that are meant to align us with both so that we can work with our present condition more skillfully and also turn within to experience that fullness, that wholeness, that sacredness that's present in every moment. I hope to see you then. Namaste.